uh, Dakota, thank you for the follow. I will be switching over one sec, guys. Good morning, everybody. Hopefully, uh, we're going live really shortly. Hopefully, I get chat working and all that good stuff. Uh, slightly under the weather today, guys, so bear with me. <laughs> uh, I have no clue where it came from, uh, but I am stuffed up slightly under the weather. Good morning, Mr. Dragon Blogger. Now, guys, we got a good little show for you today. Should be semi fast, I think. Shouldn't be too super long. But deals day nonetheless, right? The first couple products, of course, the first product we're going to look at is from Toner. I know you guys have seen this before, but we love Toner products. I believe this is the TC20 that we're going to be taking a look at. But before we do that, we're going to let a few people roll in here. Also, we're also doing giveaways, of course, guys. So make sure to enter that. And I will actually post this uh, huge list of giveaways while I do my little spiel. Because one of these giveaways, guys, ends tonight. The OBSBOT ME AI tracking phone mount ends tonight. So this is your last chance to enter that giveaway. So just so you know. Good morning, Joni. Now again, guys, I apologize. I am stuffed up. I think the allergies are actually getting me. <laughs> I don't know if it's allergies or if it's all of the cocktail smoking I've been doing, testing. Uh, it's getting to me and it's like just really heads clogged. That's my wing, guys. <laughs> uh, yeah, definitely make sure you're entered. Uh, it does end tonight at midnight. We will draw the winner tomorrow, of course, and then announce it. And what's that? There's something on my hat. Evans, buddy. Um, my weather has been really, really, really weird around here. So we're going from hot to cold to hot to cold. Then it snows one day, then it's hot the next day. And it's just stomping me right now. I ah, thank you. This is from our merch store, guys. We do have these. I believe this one might be from our Streamlabs merch store. But we do have a lot of merch out there now on our merch store for up grabs, guys. So, of course, always check out the merch store if you guys really like it. Uh, so, again, guys, a lot of giveaways going on. Uh, make sure to enter the two gift card giveaways today. Uh, I do not have the link on top of my hand. I have a... Let me see if I can grab it. I probably can. Do, 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 copy. Now, I don't know if I'm allowed to do this. We'll see. That actually came through. All right, cool. So that's the merch store. A lot of stuff there. A lot of cool products. We'll have more coming through. So like I said, guys, we're going to be doing toner up first. Of course, this is our TC20. Uh, great little product. I'm going to switch over to here. I'm going to switch over to here. Hopefully you guys see this. Uh, I just lost everything, of course. Why? Oh, why? It's one of these mornings already. There we go. You guys can watch this. So you can get this entire set. Awesome here. little product, guys. It's going to come with this boom arm. It's going to come with a cable to plug the it lighting in. just fell it's off my desk. It's going to come with a shock mount. Sad. It's going to come with a pop filters. I need so more it mounts. Allows it to not have, um, allows it to Govee, not have if you're watching, I need more rope it. LED you mounts. Get a mic sock right here. Please. Um, so one of the coolest <laughs> things about this mic, I didn't know when they sent it. Um, I didn't know they were sending it at all, actually. But Tonor usually makes USB microphones. This TC20 is actually a condenser uh, microphone, but it uses um, that standard audio port right here. So this is a non-USB, so you actually have to have, um, you have to have a audio interface, but you get better quality out of it. All right, guys, so now we are using the Tonor TC20. Uh, this microphone sounds so good. I did a little bit of testing 
right before we did this video. It sounds absolutely so good. And one of the coolest things is it does come with everything you need to get going except for your audio interface. But the fact that it comes with a pop filter, it comes with the wind sock, it comes with everything you need to get going right out of the box. It's crazy. I mean, this is the best quality I've seen from Toner. They make they make quality products in general. And I was actually really surprised with the quality of this microphone. I'm actually going to leave it the way it's set up now. And I'm using NVIDIA Broadcast with it right now, which is actually pretty cool. Yeah, like I said, guys, this is the Tonor TC20 microphone, no. XLR microphone. It sounds so good. I'm going to switch back over to the main screen and my Yeti X now. And you guys might actually hear a downgrade in quality, which is absolutely crazy to me. All right, guys, and now we are <laughs> back with yeah. the Yeti X. I don't know if I need one of everything, so, but yeah, like you know, I, said, guys, I do need some more mounts. TC20. It sounds... I mean, it sounds ridiculous. I didn't know Tonor made an XLR microphone. Um, luckily, I had an audio interface. Otherwise, they just would have sent it to me, and I wouldn't have been able to really test it for you guys. You get all of that. So if you guys have been looking to get yourself um, a better setup for your Zoom calls, if you work from home, if you guys game, if you guys make... So that is the Toner TC20, guys. Now, I'm going to mention a couple things and go back over kind of a couple things he actually mentioned himself. Guys, the... Why is my everything out of uh, whack? That is weird. So I'm going to apologize for that right now. Uh, pictures out of whack. You, it is an XLR, so you will need uh, you know, an interface for that because of the plug. It's a three-prong uh, round circle style plug. You know, it won't work on your PC unless you have that interface. Second, he is using the NVIDIA broadcast system, which actually helps with the background removal software, which is really, really great and actually very cool. Now, I'm going to try and adjust this, and hopefully the next product we go to, guys, shows up properly, and it did not. So I am not sure why everything is out of whack. It's going to be one of these days. Good morning, fellas. Good morning, Pastor Jack. Good morning, Candy. Good morning, everybody. Welcome, guys. Okay, so the next product, guys, we're going to actually talk about is from Top Pin. Top Pin, I actually have this stick vacuum. I use this vacuum daily. I actually got rid of my Dyson vacuum. I quit using my Dyson for this Top Pin. It works so well that I'd rather use this cordless vacuum than my Dyson. If that sounds strange at all, this one actually works really, really great. It picks up more stuff than my Dyson did. It is easier to clean. It just works phenomenally better, and it is lighter than my Dyson Animal uh, V10. I believe it is the Animal. Uh, but we're going to show you guys this little vacuum. Uh, yeah, it does happen when I, stuff gets messed around with, and I was messing with stuff trying to get a video to work beforehand. And with me not feeling as good as normal, it James probably messes with stuff. Today with a quick unboxing, we showcase of a new product. This is from Top Pen. This is our six in one stick vacuum. As you guys can see, the box is upside down. That's for a reason, because the handle, so it will not sit properly. But if you guys look, this is the cordless S2 stick vacuum, which is pretty cool. Um, we'll discuss this before we start opening this. This is, you know, it's a tangle free brush roller. It has a 150 watt uh, motor in it. It yeah, is we a can max. Kind of jump forward, guys, guys and I'll show you guys this actually instead of boring you that with the unboxing. Oops. I did not clip it right. So that is how you pull it apart. Top, power button, vacuum is definitely. It does have several filters, guys, if you need to clean them. It has two motor modes. It does have a motorized, you know, uh, bottom piece, which is very cool. That's pretty cool. Now, there are more pieces. This is where we're going to pull this apart and move the box off the table for you guys. We no longer have the box. They're all behind us. Inside this box, there's going to be all kinds of heads, attachments, and all that good jazz. First is a hose. Keeps going black. I see hose. that too. Stretchable hose connector. So this is pretty cool. I mean, if you really want, take the green plug, connect it down just like that. 
Good morning, like Alan. That. And you guys can guys, see make sure you want enter. To uh, you if you guys don't know, don't the Ob's bot in me uh, ends tonight, so the winner the will be drawn tomorrow. The utensil. Now you have a longer stick. Set that aside. Grab some more attachments. This is just, you know, your standard nozzle attachment to get in behind crevices, creases in your cars. This is pretty good. Now, I yes, so many giveaways and we got more playing. Always. Yeah, so the, the Obspot Amy AI tracking actually this ends at midnight, really, really guys. Nice. So make sure to enter that last one if you vacuum. haven't. This is also so. good for your car or in your couches. Slide, you've got the brush if you need a little scrubbing. I believe nice the EF Echo Flow River mini giveaway cool. ends in like nine days, maybe. I can't eat. remember how many and days. This is the best part of it all. This is the powered carpet bottom. This is the rollers. The rollers move from power. So we're going to jump this forward, guys. I believe. Yeah, this here we go. I'm move. You can see this. I will give you if guys you guys want to see what I do to my okay, floor, guys, guys watch this. Change views. I'm going to show you guys this. I this is the stuff ice. I do for you guys. If you guys can see this. I'm gonna Bunch of rice. I'm gonna step on it, crush we'll it move in. It around. <laughs> you guys can see all this. I will move the camera back some more so you guys can see this. We're gonna actually vacuum uh, this up and see how well the it does. Stuff I do. Nope. There's another one down at the bottom. I'm giving my personal one away. Now, Brand new, right, still so unopened. Kick it around. But as you guys see, it's actually vacuuming up pretty good. <laughs> so disrespectful to the rice. How well it's picking up the rice. The We're amount of rice I waste for vacuum charges. videos. This is just the charge straight from the factory. <laughs> so you're gonna get more power out of this. You guys turn it up higher. You know. See this? It's rice, so it'll bounce, and you'll have to go back over. It works well. Um, you know ah, yes. Because it's a pain to get up. See how well this vacuums up. Turn the volume down. So you have three modes. All good. Medium, high, low, medium, high. bring this to you as you guys can see in this it picked up all that rice and the rice is actually dirty that's kind of cool so that's the top pin vac guys it is a phenomenal vacuum that actually works really really great i highly recommend it and it's like what 119 right now i do not know if there's a clippable coupon but for 119 for a rechargeable cordless vacuum this thing just blows me away i mean it's actually i'm telling you it works better than my dyson which just just crazy now we're going to be moving on to another product. This is from uh, Insignia, I believe. This is their 42-inch Class uh, F20 Series Smart TV. It's like $229 right now, so we're going to show hey you guys, guys this. Hey guys, my name is Demetrius, and I'm going to be showing you guys this Insignia Fire TV that came in a 42-inch How is LED everybody's week going so far, by display. the way? It has a HDMI ports, as I'll show you later in the video. And it's that F20 series. And it also has that press and ask Alexa feature on there. Really, really awesome TV so far. It came in a really solid box. Um, as you can see, it has the remote at the top. And That's extra awesome. padding at the top. Guys, as I'm yeah, show you how we are giving two gift cards away. Stuff that came Make sure with. to enter. It has both feet. Let's set to the bottom of the TV if you wanted it. And then you have the child safety piece of form. And then you will have next is the TV child remote, safety the form. manual, and then you have some uh, batteries in there too. Uh, the batteries, if it didn't come with it, the batteries you'll use is a that AAA That tells battery. you how light that TV it comes is. comes in this plastic too to protect that screen of that glossy look. Uh, there you have it. Uh, and I forgot to order my monitor. LED I F put HD. In. F20 series Insignia Fire TV. Really, really clean look, as you can see. 
Then it has that energy guide, yellow little sticker on there. Comes in a uh, plastic film all around the edges. And here's the back of the TV. You have all these connectors right here, the HDMIs, and then you have the USB, of course, and then you have the cable cord, and then on the bottom you time. have the... Yeah, as you guys also red, see on the back, it also has a wall mount, so you could wall mount this you if you wanted. That with, uh, That's kind of cool. Game system, and then you have the cable cord. So you can use those four spots right there if you want to put a TV mount on there, and it comes with the screws labeled right there. And then you have the power connector that came with a safety little power connector thing and has a zip lock uh, little now zip tie. If I could beat this little connector. head cold I got, so it'd that, be great. Uh, the battery is pretty much simp simply easy to put in. Uh, take it the uh, remote out of the plastic and then uh, you just have a little notch right there on the back where you just slide down on the remote and then it'll just simply just pop right off. So with that being said, like I said, it has a lot of updating and a lot of software updating that it does. It takes about five minutes to update everything. And, uh, hmm. really, now, of course, really guys, this is a Fire so TV, so it is and an Android-based TV. There you have it. So you will always the have Equalizer updates. Two is displayed on Inside screen, here, pretty much, you can, and I'll talk really about it. Per Inside with the Fire TV is pretty much you can use anything and everything, including it'll have Amazon Prime. It should even have... have Amazon shopping built in if you guys want to shop from your TV like my TV it will do that It's press to talk TV, so it's not like mine, but it's a full-on TV at 42 inches guys at $229 not a bad deal Yeah, glad you guys are all here. You know, we truly appreciate everybody showing up uh, You know beforehand Justin asked me if I was good enough to go on I said we were gonna push through this of course you know, I'm not going to just walk away just for a little head cold. So, that is the Insignia 42-inch Fire TV, the F20 series, guys. Great smart TV if you need a, a decent one. Now, we're going to move over to the next product. This is from 110. This is their IdeaPad 3. Hey, Jennifer. Now, we're going to actually show you the page of this, guys. This is a laptop, of course, right? Laptop 14-inch with an FHD display. It does have the AMD Ryzen 5 5500U CPU, which is a nice CPU. 8 gigabytes of RAM, 250 gigabytes of storage, but if you need to upgrade that, you always could later on down the line. Now, it does have the Radeon 7 graphics card, so you can actually play games from it if you need to, right? Now, they do have other options from the 15.6 inch or the 15.6 AMD R5 which is just the upgraded version of this one. Now, 14 inches with Windows 11, you can do anything and everything you really need to on this laptop. And at $429, it's not a bad deal. It's like $101 off right now. It does come in multiple colors. The one we are showing you is the Abyss Blue, but they do have, I believe, like a gray and a black if you need to. So if you have any questions, this is a nice little option for those that actually need a laptop out there. We thought we'd throw that in there and give you guys a little uh, option of that. Hey, Jimmy. Good morning, buddy. Now, we are going to move on to the next little product. I know we're going to slide a little fast. And that's because, you know, products. Now, we're going to showcase, guys. This is the JBL portable Bluetooth speaker. We're going to let this play. So, this is my little JBL this. Clip 4 speaker. I just unboxed it. and Make sure to enter our giveaways, so guys. I demonstrate how it works and everything it's just really super simple i like to listen to music while i shower and so this is going to be a nice little thing that i can clip on while you shower stand and use well, it is waterproof um it, it's telling us about his daily his daily routines where's in canada when we need him ip67 waterproof and dust proof and has up to 10 hours of play time um it's really easy to use as you can see this little light is on and not flashing so that's how you know it's connected it has two buttons right here that you can kind of see this is the power button you just power hold it for bluetooth. a little bit to turn it on and then if you want to connect it to a bluetooth you just hold this for about two seconds and then you're good as you can see on the front it has some controls that's play different placements for buttons YouTube that's kind of cool i'm going to play some music different from my phone so you guys can hear how it sounds so just automatically you can see and I'm uh probably comes in multiple colors too i bet 
nice and then lower the volume also. What's the secret word then, already uh, mentioned? No, the secret word was not mentioned. It is topic. Onyx so, Dragon. As you can see, it's a really nice little speaker. It does have a good amount of volume and bass to it. And it's just really nice overall to use. So, so Onyx Dragon is the secret word if you so need it. Hey, Angelo. How you doing, buddy? Check this one out. So that is the little JVL speaker, guys. Just a quick little showcase of it. Quick little clip. Now, if you guys all need, and this is probably something I need right now, is a cool Mr. Aqua Oasis uh, to get rid of this head cold that I have going on. Uh, anytime, no problem. Truly appreciate that I can help you with that. We're going to pop over. We're going to show you guys this. This is an ultrasonic uh, mister, and I probably could use so it as a guarantee right Aqua now. this is Oasis Cool Mist Humidifier. The reason why I have if you guys like need the links to the giveaways, uh, here's all of our giveaways like active right now. You definitely don't want to put water in this part right here when it's right side up. You have to turn it upside down and unscrew this part right here. And then once you do that, you can fill Maybe I need fix in. vapor rub. It took me a while to figure that out because it doesn't come with instructions and there's not real clear instructions on the product page either. So that's just one thing that I wanted to point out. But once you put water in there, you can go ahead and put it in here and flip it over. And you don't have to worry about it leaking because... Um, the water won't come out the bottom until this part is pressed into here. So go ahead and put that in there, and the water should. It's a cool product, especially if you got it's got head head colds or just trying to get rid of congestion. They work well, especially if you add the vapor rub mixture into it, or just let it like moisture up your air. It starts coming out almost immediately. Now it does come with this nice little bag that you can see here. And this is, you're gonna wanna put this top on. I didn't put it on before just to kind of show you guys how to put it together. So once you do, you can put this on here and then it'll start feeding mist out of the top of it. Now what's cool about this thing is, is that it provides dry air relief and it works from 12 to 24 hours just depending on how you wanna set it and how much mist and stuff you wanna come out based on this little nozzle here. Um, quick and simple and easy to set out more mist and basically it has an automatic shut off a 2.2 liter container and it, as uh, advertised it's basically silent you can't hear it do anything um and so that's one thing that i think is really cool because some will make bubbling sounds some will you know you can hear the mist coming out but this one is absolutely silent so if you're looking for a nice humidifier to make sure you get rid of uh, the dry environment that you're in. This is definitely one that you're gonna check out. It is the Aqua Oasis Cool Mist Humidifier, and you know, it looks really cool. So that's the Aqua Oasis, guys. Nice little product, especially would be useful right now. Maybe I should break mine out. Now we're gonna pop over to the next product, and guys, this again is another product from Toner. This is the T20, so this is just the boom arm of the last product, the, the last toner product that we showed. So we're just going to kind of talk about it and pop over to the page. So the TC20 comes with the mic. This is the T20. It's just the boom arm with the extended base. Now it does come with four Velcro straps. It comes with the windsock, wind pop, plus the adjustment knobs and the hangers. This is a very strong. Now they claim this can actually hold, and you guys can see this, four pounds or three Blue Yeti X microphones. That is just phenomenal to be able to hold that. And with the th the 3.8 to 5.8 adapter, guys, that actually is really cool because a lot of different mics use different size of adapters to screw them on and hang them. Very cool little product. I highly recommend toner products, guys. Uh, we use them a lot. We actually, I have this one still in my closet that I plan on using very shortly once I start getting the rest of my stuff rolling in for my uh, for my setup. If you guys have any questions about any of the products that we have foreseen or mentioned so far in this stream, please ask, guys. We're always here to answer and try to help as much as we can. Now, as you guys see, I have that clamped onto my uh, kitchen table right there. I do not suggest that because your wife may uh, get very offended that you're using her tables to test products. Of course, then again, I do a lot of stuff that I probably shouldn't do for my, depending on my wife. Uh, it's better to, uh, you know, ask for forgiveness later. <laughs> Any questions, guys? 
while I take a couple minute break here and let my head clear. Hey, buddy. Good morning, man. Nice to see you. Glad you could pop in. <laughs> I mean, I really do a lot, a lot of testing on stuff that I, I shouldn't do. Uh, compared to my, you know, what my wife would think. But then again, you know, she doesn't complain a lot by luck. Promo fix. Uh, you know, I could probably just grab a cough drop and probably clear my head. But I'm lazy today. So, guys, the next product is from Syncom. This is their eye massager. Now, if you guys don't know the story about this product, I believe this is the one that Justin's dog actually ate. So we're going to kind of show you guys the video of this, if this is the one I think it is. Syncom Eye Massager. And it is. This is the Syncom Eye Massager. <laughs> now, this is a very unique product. This is the second eye massager I've ever reviewed because I didn't even know these type of products existed. <laughs> so this is the second yes. one I reviewed. Yes. Uh, pumpkin likes to chew stuff. Over, especially um, if it makes noises no or he brand. thinks he can attack it. So he didn't like this. Yeah, see, there it is. It's the sound. So it's like a vacuum to him. He hears that air sound and it's like, move on. As well as little, I think of them like airbags that that expand and inflate and then contract. Combine that with heat. And what this is designed to do is you wear it around your eyes. Exactly. He had a really nice spendy dog chew toy for about 10 seconds and it was over. heat to help relieve eye strain and stress around your eyes. And the previous one I reviewed was just airbags. It didn't have as much heat, and it did not have those rolling balls. So I'll be honest with you, I was afraid to try this thing because when I heard it has shiatsu rolling balls, I was worried about these little like you know beads or something rolling over my eyeballs, even with my eyes. It happens, you know. The charges via USB C. It on, happens to the best of us. You on. know, it could have been that, or it could have showed up damaged. You know, everything ha happens that's, that's for cool. a reason. No fancy buttons to use. It just starts working. So, right now, I don't know if you can hear it on the microphone, but it's doing vibrations and just did a hissing. I actually hear the air. So it's testing. like a little hiss. Now it's rolling the little balls around my eye, and I feel it rolling. And again, you can adjust the strap and loosen it or tighten it as you need to. It's making vibration noises. I'll try to get this closer to the mic. Can you hear this? I can hear the air popping back like and forth, but I don't hear the, uh, the, airbags the vibrations, though. It's actually getting really warm. I actually definitely feel the warmth. Now, I get migraines quite often, actually. The heat from this, when I have my eye... If you ever have migraines, if you're familiar with migraines, sometimes your eyeballs feel hard like marbles. They hurt so Another that mystery coupon I got on the spin to win roulette. Hard and solid. Oh, right on, man. The heat from this and the massage, I totally forgot we had that um, thing. Pressure from this really is comforting. The noise is uh, not so bad that I can't fall asleep while wearing it. Hey, I, shut off I put all my cycle. stuff up. But this one has right more into a hole. and the rolling balls on it that the other one that I tested didn't have. The other one was just airbags that inflated and deflated. And it actually gets really hot. My like, brows get sweaty. It's to convert that garage into a cool recording product. studio. Really, really, really cool. And the cool thing is that it travels by folding. You can just fold it up like this. This one uses micro USB to charge. I wish they would use USB-C because then the same charger... You know, the same cord to charge your open move could charge this. Everything should be USB-C. I can't say this enough. I want to see every device use USB-C. I agree with him. And he so that is the Syncom Eye Massager, guys. Nice little product. Uh, it was so nice that Pumpkin decided it was his. Now we're going to move on to 3-axis gimbal, guys. I'm not actually going to show you the video of this. We're going to actually go over and we're going to pop open the page a bit talk about this because since I actually have this product, I can talk about this product. Now they have a multiple two to products and you guys can see from this page, it does have a 5% clippable coupon. Now the one we're showing you here is actually for the phone, but they also make one for like your GoPros. They also make one that can actually work with your phone, GoPro, and your mini cameras kind of like... Your Sony Alphas, you know, I have the Sony A5000. Uh, even though that's broke, it's still there. I, I'm i not really sure it could hold this, the Sony ZV-10, but it could hold like the Sony ZV-1 and work. The cool thing was, uh, does this have a light? Um, 
you know, this does not have a light, but it does have an app where it can do AI controlled if you're talking about the gimbal, which is really cool. It can actually track you. You use the tripod, put it on there, and the phone app will actually track the camera, kind of like the OBSBOT. Now, it does, this one actually has the remote control, which is kind of cool compared to the others. This has the remote so you can start and stop your uh, videos. It also gives you more control over the gimbal itself, so you can kind of position it or move it with it as you go. Now, if you've never used the gimbal, they're really great to help stabilizing your video image or just trying to get that perfect shot while doing like little spins. It's a really cool product. Now, I actually have tested this. It will work with my Samsung S21. It will work with the my uh, Apple phone, and it will also work with my ZTE Blade X. Now, if you guys look at the size difference of these phones, there is quite a big size difference in these products. Now, I'm gonna show you guys the, uh, the iPhone next to it, right? So being able to have that many options of phones and work inside the gimbal is really, really cool because some, some gimbals do not have that big adjustment. This one will actually do it. It will hold even an iPhone 13, which is just crazy. Now we'll kind of come over here and kind of show you guys this. This does have the steady, er, steady anti-shake axis built into it, which is really cool. To help stabilize it now this is what i want to talk about this has a 10 hour battery life it has a battery life where you can actually plug in a usb c to device to it and keep your phone powered with it on top of that that way you can get like a long explode or ex explode or explode i can't speak today exposure of a picture or like a uh, you know uh a picture that goes on for like hours upon hours it will actually do that and you can power it from the gimbal also so let's say your phone starts to die while it's plugged in it also has the battery power from the gimbal which is just a great option to have that if you guys have any questions about this please ask even though I'm stuttering like a fool today uh, it is like a half pound so it just barely weighs anything guys it is like seven inches folded out completely or in folded length. Once it's folded out, it's a little longer. Then you have the little tripod. I like these products. So any questions, please ask. Highly recommend that thing. Now we're going to pop over to the next little product, guys. This is the Simtrex, uh, Simtech Crystal Clear Case. I'm here Maybe showcasing I need more the sleep. Simtech crystal clear case, which has a kickstand. Now, this case is for the <laughs> iPhone 12 Pro Max or iPhone today. 13 Pro Max. And as you can see, it comes with camera lens protectors, but not just one. It comes with two camera lens protectors. Now, these are really cool because you stick these over your camera lenses. <laughs> yeah, and guys. that extra the protection wind. so that you Enter can't have wind. your camera lenses get scratched. Or it's just one of these dusty days. From fingerprints. And Lack the of sleep, of head. You ruin the adhesiveness. So one of them I'm sitting in front of bright lights. Backup. Here's the case itself. You also get a lint-free cloth and their warranty card that comes with it. Now, the unique thing about the case itself is it's your and typical crystal clear case, non-skid, non-yellowing, <laughs> but it also includes this little metal kickstand, which they Maybe call it a free kickstand because you could stand your phone up vertically. You could stand up. This I way, like how this phone gives you the option the that the stand works in multiple phone kind of positions. Tilts upward facing you, but you could also turn the kickstand over as well, like this. So you actually have three ways you could use the kickstand. It's a strong enough metal kickstand that it will actually let it stand in altered ways, and it doesn't close super easy, although. If you want to close it, you just press it closed. But it is does require a little bit of force, so that's the way it works all three ways. So let's go ahead and put my iPhone 12 Pro Max in it. Pull off the plastic here. Easy to snap your phone in. Really quick that goes on. Now, it's we can all just take and stare at the doggy. Because that is still a great working picture. A clamp mount. So you can see how it looks here. It's non <laughs> skin, awesome. non yellowing. It just lets you see your phone right through the case. Doesn't add much thickness, as I said. And again, I really like this kickstand. This is really nice for you to set your phone down if you need to basically just have it facing you and have something to look at to where it can point up if you're above it or even reverse it the other way or have it vertically. So it's strong enough that it stands vertically. A lot of case kick 
kickstands don't let your phone stand vertically, and this one does. So a lot of versatility and a lot of options here. I really like the kickstand. I also like that it includes the camera lens cover, which you just pull off right here, and it's adhesive. So you just line it up and stick it over your three camera lenses right here. It fits perfectly into the slot of the case and adds that extra protection. So not only do you get the border protection around the camera lenses that's bumped out, but you also get complete protection so that way you can't get fingerprints, now, smudges, or scratches. The on one thing lenses. I'm going to say before you guys put that camera case uh, cover on for the cameras, make sure that you clean your camera lenses first very well. That way you don't have no finger smudges in between that and the stick on cover. But as you guys see, the Simtech crystal clear case is very, very nice. Now, it is actually thin enough that it will work with wireless charging. So you guys are good there if you really need. Now, we're going to move over to the Hummix car phone holder, guys. And I can't remember who did this one. I don't know if it was me or... No, nope, it was Nate. So this Hater is the Nate mount did right this, guys. here. I'll kind of show you guys the accessories it comes with. So basically, this is everything oh. it comes with. So this part is basically going to... There's a little sticky pad here that's like going to sneeze. sit somewhere on your dash or somewhere else in your car, or even if you guys want it like in your house, you could do that too. What this is going to do is just sit down there, and then this portion right here, what you'll do is you'll basically peel this off. I haven't done the video on this yet, but you'll peel this off, and it'll sit on there. And once it's sitting on there, all you have to really do is just basically pull that down, and that's going to create the suction that holds this to the surface that you installed this on. So we'll go ahead and lift that back up. So it does have some different port, uh, different points of articulation, I guess you could say. So right here, what this is going to allow you to do, this knob here, it's going to allow you to basically adjust it up and down. So if you have different viewing angle needs, you can definitely... He said clap, clap. I don't know how to find the emojis. <laughs> it's okay. That's, that, that's okay. <laughs> that's all right. So this is going to allow you to basically adjust it to the viewing need that, I mean, I guess you desire. So go ahead and tighten that up. Another point of articulation is going to be right here. And what this is going to allow you to do is when you loosen this up, it's basically going to allow you to extend this. So say like maybe the portion on your dash that's closest to you isn't exactly flat, but further back there is. What you can do is basically put the whole mechanism further back and then extend this out towards you so you don't lose any of that kind of like viewing angle, which is pretty cool. It can extend out pretty far. That's as far as it goes. And then it can obviously shrink all the way back down. You can tighten it up. So say you want it halfway, about like that. Actually, very cool mount that can do all those uh, different it's very movements. sturdy. And as you can see here, that's not going to budge at all. So now switching over here to the front, this material right here, Humix went ahead and decided to just kind of put in this real soft touch material. So maybe if you don't use a phone case or you do have a phone case, you don't want it to get like scratched up. This isn't going to scratch up the back of your phone or your phone case. 100 LOL, the fire emoji. Yeah, so this isn't going to scratch your I phone apologize. or God, scratch your phone guys. case. Right here, another point of articulation, if you have a taller phone, what this is going to allow you to do is you basically just pull this down and that'll extend roughly about an inch. So if you have a taller phone, you can definitely put it in there and you won't have to worry about it being too lopsided over the top. And then one of the coolest things about this is to put your phone in here, all you simply have to do is on the side, if you guys can see it here, all you have to do is just basically push that in and this will automatically extend out. So then what you can do, oh, excuse me, <coughs> that was rough. What you can do is basically put your phone in here like this or just drop it. Exactly on like that. that. Just drop works. it on the ground. Don't worry about it, guys. So basically you're just going to put it in here like this, clamp it down. You don't want to like squeeze it too tight because you obviously don't want to break guys. the plastic. But as you can see here, that's not going to go anywhere. I mean, this is super solid. I am shaking it and it's not moving. It definitely clamps down really tight. So then say you get home and all you all have right, and better. then you want to basically just take your phone off of the mount. All you have to do is just push in those little side buttons that I showed you guys just a few seconds ago and it'll release it and you can just pop it right off. So simple as that. There's not really much to it. It does have very solid plastic. Nothing feels cheap or flimsy on it. Now, guys, one thing to mention, if you have problems with it uh, sticking or, uh, you know, with the suction cup, add a little water on it. Just slightly dampen it. It'll actually make the suction more stronger. <laughs> and I apologize. Now the coughing's kicking in. 
But that is a cool little phone case or phone holder for the car, guys, if you need something like that. Now, as you guys see, Nate has a very, very big phone, and it will actually hold it. Now, we're going to move over to a product from Eufy, guys. This is actually from Anchor. If you guys know Eufy, Anchor is actually a great little place. We're going to showcase this product. This is a product we were checking out. It's actually really cool. This is the Eufy Security or the Eufy 2C 2Cam Kit. Now, this is a 1080p HD night vision kit, guys, with IP67, which means it is water resistant, right? Uh, no monthly fees, guys. Works well. 180-day battery life. So, these two products, each product has a charge. Now, the camera can hold a charge for 180 days of usage time, which is just crazy to think of that it's fully char rechargeable and can work. Now, as you guys can see, the color mode is, you know, with the spotlight on, works very well and looks great. Or if you want just infrared mode, it can do that also. Now, just remember, if you use the spotlight, of course, it's going to drain the battery a little more. Now, the cool thing is it does have a 16 gigabyte built in for storage, but you can also get a three kit or multiple kit. It does have a $10 clipable coupon. Now we're going to go down here and talk about this. It does have alerts, so it can alert you to your phone or to whatever device that you download the app to, which is really great. It'll also keep recordings or live footage no matter what you, however you want it. So pretty much 180 days on a single charge is just phenomenal of a way to use this. Now we can go down here and show you guys some more of the stuff in this. Now, we're hoping to get one of these to show you guys this. I believe I actually have this kit coming myself. So, I believe I'm going to be the one that's going to be testing this, which is going to be great. Uh, I really need new security cameras in my house. I do have security cameras in my apartment, but it's time to upgrade them, of course. Now, they do have the military-grade encryption, the AES-128 data encryption. Uh, you know, it's just an encryption. Uh, Three-month local storage, so it can store up to 16 gigabytes of EMC squared on the device, but connect it up to your PC, and you'll get a lot more. Now, we're going to kind of show you guys this. It is 1080p. It does have a 135-degree uh, viewing angle, the six-month battery life, plus waterproof, of course. It does have human detection, so it's got the built-in AI. does have spotlight. It's not really anti-theft. Because, I mean, you are mounting it outside. I mean, they could still take it if they really wanted to. Now, the video storage built-in is 16 gigabytes of the EMMC square. Uh, or you can do the three months usage. Or you can expand it to your PC. There's no monthly fee, so do not worry about that. This is just a great little product. And I cannot wait to get my hands on it. Now... If you have any questions about that security cam, please ask. I mean, it's $179 right now. Not a bad price. If not, we're going to move over to this next product. Guys, this is from Govi. If you guys have not seen this product, I showcased it yesterday. This is Govi, of course. I love Govi products. This is their wall sconces. This is a four light kit. I love this kit. I set this up. I did a little quick video. And I'm actually going to come over here. And I'm going to show you guys the video, and hopefully I have it set up so you guys can Today actually watch this. Today we're going to take a look at a new product from Govi, guys. This is our RGBIC wall sconces. Now, what is a yeah, wall sconce? Yeah, I love Govi lights. It's a little LED or a little light that you set up on the wall to, like, project up on the wall to showcase, like, an item or just to have a nice lighting effect across the wall. Now, of now, course, of this course, works with their app, app their full Govi app, app, of course, guys. Their Govi now, I'm going to let you guys watch this whole thing because um, I cannot fast forward this. This is actually a video on my PC that has not yourself. been uh, uploaded yet hey, to the website. Work with, you know, um, Alexa and all of that other So cool you guys stuff, have seen the video right? before it's released. Um, you can also use it for, like, uh, to change the lighting. You can do all of that cool stuff. But what really comes in this kit... Let's show it to you guys and give you a quick little look. Now I'm going to set it down to the side, of course, guys, because, you know, pulling out is going to be a little bit different. Now first you get four of the wall sconces. Of course, you guys see this. It does have a little angled base, so it will not sit completely flat because it's not meant to. But on the back here, you'll have the in and out power plug on these. You get four of these, right? 
So I'm not going to pull out all four. We get four of them to daisy chain together. Yeah, dude, I love the Gobi lights. I have their rope LEDs on, on my desk. I need to remount them properly. They just didn't have enough clips to mount it. So I gotta find a way to three adhesive right, right. it or super glue so it on permanently. Power cord right here, right? Uh, then we have some wall style power, power cord or plug. And then we come in here, and you will have. Now these wall sconces are cool. So let's say if you have some art in the house so that you can show off, or some family photos, or maybe you just want to light up a doorway outside your house. This thing is really cool that you can set up. See, you have your first in and out plug, so you would grab. Now the one thing is, is once you clip it in, it is hard to unclip it. I actually had to use like little tweezers. Or a knife to like kind of unclip and then it, you would pull go back on out. To the so make sure you have it positioned that you want it. Is, is once it's in, guys, you ain't getting it back out unless you have tricks and trades. Hmm. So right here is the rest of your stuff, and this is what we'll show you. You have the connection of the cables. It is started. This is the rest of the connecting in and out for the rest of the wall sconces. Plus you have the wall mounts now you can screw this into the wall just like this right guys and then now there is a hole for these guys that will actually let the wires on the mounts like go through so you don't have to worry about it pinching or anything also connect it like that now just remember you will need a little area for and that's why it's angled and we'll show you guys this it's angled for a reason that's so your wire could have a little opening space very simple very easy guys you also have your wall plugs if you need wall plugs and screws and three more of these now i'm not going to permanently mount these so what i'm going to do is i'm going to set these up on a wall so you guys can see the lighting effect if you guys give me a second we'll do that and we'll show you guys this okay now that we got the go v wall sponsors hooked up guys as you can see so that is how bright those are guys now what we're going to do is we're going to move over to color mode, right? We're going to select a pattern. You know, red, green. And we're going to uncheck that. Check that. Check that. We're going to go red with that one. You can do your own patterns. There are multiple red. scenes you can use. I, it's just amazing. Green, as you guys see, we can do a red green pattern. Or if we check all, oh, we can go to like blue. I'd we love a daisy chain to like eight of them. We, we Would have been great. Over. We can set up some <laughs> patterns with some scenes. You guys can see the effects there. That is Aurora. We can do forest. We can do flowers. Rainbow effect. It'll actually change back and forth. You guys can see the pattern. Starry sky, of course, right? Which is rather cool. Then Firefly. You guys want me to keep playing this video? Let me know. Or we can move on to the next product. It's up to you guys. But these Gobi sconces, man, are super bright. Valentine's Day. Well, we can go to Emotion, right? This we can do a movie night. Romance. Candle flicker. Breathing effect. You guys see it's red. It's going to change breathing colors. Now it's going to go yellows. Um, dance should be right there. But I actually like dance. Dance is kind of cool. Now then we have relaxation. I like the coloration of the dance. Dream. That is the Govi Light Sconces, guys. I highly recommend Govi products. I have not had a bad product from them yet. It's just crazy how cool their products are if you have no questions guys we're going to move on to the next product and now we're going to talk about this this next product is actually the product that we're giving away now it is not the actual one but i have two of these so i have an unopened one besides this one that we're giving away so this is the goat this is the obsbot me ai tracking phone now here with quick showcase and unboxing of a new product from obsbot this James is here. obsbot me this is an ai powered phone i am no guys. longer saying that no this more. has That's auto it. tracking this is pretty pretty awesome for vloggers or anybody that just wants to use it while 
Like maybe in the kitchen and you want to chat with your family. Now this remember guys, this giveaway ends tonight for this guys. one. But it also works with gesture gesture control or you know a quick pick of the modes, guys. So this is foldable. This will work for about two hours on a full charge, right? This has brushless motors, guys. So you have the brushless motors with the uh, the the simple, you know, simple click gesture mode. So you can turn it on and off if you want. Thank you, Mr. Water. I was actually the just brushless looking motors for the makes it smooth and faster, <laughs> so you have no jerkiness with the no apps. You guys can use I this closed the app thing. You want, like TikTok. Yeah, ends Facebook, tonight, guys. Uh, we will be drawing chat, the winner tomorrow Skype, Instagram, and announcing YouTube, guys, that to them on everything. So, so inside this kit, what good do you luck get? to everybody that enters. I believe there's down. something like pull it out. 230 people, I think, box, maybe. Right? So Set, it's get, not a high volume of entries, which is, is the manual. crazy. Inside here it says, let me catch you up. So inside here, we'll flip it open without trying to damage this. Now, thing. guys, this does but have an app, so you can connect the what, app up to if you need guys, the app. You guys need it. It's or very, wait, no, this one doesn't have several it. Languages. It'll tell this you one just works just straight with what it is. Um, um, these first find, you. you know, but it says uh, phone holder, phone holder arm, vertical rotation axis, semi hard shell, for uh, a PU more. leather case with handle with their logo. Very nice, nice zipper. Man, this zipper is actually really good. Very smooth open. That, that's cool. Inside here, some of the stuff. We'll pop this open. Somebody first. is going to be very happy with this product, I tell you. Which it is. This product will actually be and really also, good for somebody wanting to start to streaming. Or wanting to start cool, doing videos, awesome. or four, you know, just wants four, the, five, to follow them around while they're video chatting with their friends while they're in the kitchen. Uh, you know, great little is. product. I'm not really sure. We're gonna find out in a second. This little piece is new to me. If I can actually get it out. Yeah, the funny it's thing was is when I did notice this. Let us talk about that. Not really. When I noticed that was separately wrapped, I had no clue what it was for, but it was actually for unlocking the actual product so it can actually articulate, which is just sure what that's for. We'll figure that blew out me away now. when I saw it. Now the next piece. Yeah, Obsbot, really man, cool. really great tech. I'm using their 4K web camera right now. now. I love how yeah, smooth nice it follows you, you have the and how quick it really is. Tripod, guys. Like there's no lag actually, when it follows. That's cool that they give you the tripod. Second is the device itself. Now, as you guys can see, it's foldable. It breaks down very easy. Very. So I think, so this little thing is actually to tighten this up, right? Loosen that up, right? Bust it around, now you're That's out cool. in the open. If you That's what that back, little plastic guys, tool is for. Put it back here. You could just do that or you can tighten it and then it won't come apart again. So very cool, very easy. So this thing is very cool. Just twist it if you want your phone. Let's say you want your phone in portrait mode. Yeah, the really cool part is you can go in landscape mode or portrait Simple, mode with your phone. Tripod. It will actually One work either screw, way. Right? Screws right on. Very easy, very simple, very quick. The button. Let's see if we can turn this on. It, oh, wait. Look right up as you guys can see it. It's pointing right at you guys, right? Hi, hi, hi there. Over here. Okay. Now we're going to jump forward to it actually in use. Okay. And see if it'll right here. And track me. So, if you guys give me a second, we're going to switch. This is how smooth this thing works, guys. Phone. Okay. Okay. Now that we're recorded off the phone, guys, you guys can watch it. It'll track me. It tracks me around. And it actually tracks me quite fast and smooth. I'm actually impressed with how well it works. Now, as you guys know, we're actually in. Uh, a long mode of this phone unfortunately that way it can capture my face if i was sitting down it would probably capture me just fine wide angled or setting the phone sideways but it works well it is very smooth i'm trying you know you guys can follow me so it does have a stopping motion but let's have it follow me let's see if it keeps following me follow me as you guys see it got dark in here we're in my kitchen so there's a limitation to this so that's the Obsbot Amy, guys. Really, really cool product. Highly recommend it. Again, we are giving one of those away, and it ends tonight. Now we're going to be moving on to the next little product, guys. This is from Inpet. This is our K11 wireless keyboard. 
Uh, I did not realize this was on here tonight, or I would have showed you guys the actual product. Here with a quick unboxing showcase of a new product, guys. This is from Inpet or Inpeat. This is uh, their Passion for Gaming series. This is their K11 wireless keyboard, guys. This is a 2.4 gigahertz keyboard with an 1850 milliamp battery. So you should get 200 hours of standby time, probably seven days of full use if you use it at full use, at uh, full constant use with LEDs on and patterns like that, guys. So not a big deal. You also get a 10 mil, uh, 10 meter distance. Yeah, that ob spot's really cool. Dongle because you will have to use a little mini USB dongle. Now, the one thing that they do say is there's 26 anti-ghosting keys. I would have preferred a whole keyboard with anti-ghosting, which would have been great, but should not be an issue. Now, there are several LED, uh, LED indicators on this guy's with seven several patterns <laughs> so you'll get like i believe it's seven different rgb lightings with four different effects and several brightness levels and we'll kind of walk you through all that of course as we go we're well, actually going to jump so it's there we're going to show you guys this with manual, it lit up if you need it manual here kind of walk you through all the what the most yeah keys this was a new brand that, that we were just starting yeah. to work with it's actually a really decent keyboard if you want and to it's the LEDs you know decently LEDs. priced now if you want to change the brightness we'll kind of talk about it a little instead of showing the whole video let's talk about it i'll top over to web camera so this what this keyboard guys is actually it's not a full mechanical keyboard but it is water resistant so if you have if you have a little spill on it You'll be able to clean it off a little better, uh, unlike, you know, like my mechanical keyboard I use daily. If you're looking for a keyboard that's, you know, like decently priced and works well, this keyboard is just that. It's actually really great. Now, you don't have a palm or uh, palm placement, but, you know, not everybody needs it. The great part is it is wireless. Now, you will need a USB plug for the dongle because the dongle, if you guys don't know, looks like this and plugs in and works. Now, of course, I have a dongle in my PC for my gaming controller that is somewhere to be determined. I have lost it. Uh, but keyboard, man, it's got seven different lighting effects, guys. You can adjust the lighting up and down. Very easy, very simple. It has media keys. It has the function keys. It's got a full keyboard, full number pad. It works well. I've actually sat down and used it on the PC back there. For about a week or so, just testing it so I can actually say how well it worked. It works really good. Now, the lighting looks great. Now, you're not going to get a full, like, app for the lighting, which you don't really need. I mean, it's just a rainbow effect or breathing effect or just plain colors breathing in and out. Yeah, it's actually a really cool keyboard. Now, like I said, we won't bore you with the whole thing, but I'll actually jump over real quick. Let's see if I can pull up some of the lighting effects and kind Maybe of show you guys It'll this. change a couple of the patterns, oh. right? Here's your Pulling lighting colors. Just like that. Grab the function key, guys. Now, the, function the plus and minus on your number pad will actually change the effects or change see. different styles. The down for the brightness up. Function key. Um, Unlike in this video, I did not realize that at first. That's why I could not get it to switch to many patterns. Well, but not a bad color. And as you guys can see just from that view, it actually is very decent. Now we're going to pop over to uh, the top pin. I believe this is a top pin Steam Vac. I'm going to show Absolutely you guys this. Absolutely beastly Steam Mop that I have right here. This is made by Toppin or Topin. I don't know how you say it. Toppin. But close enough so this is exactly how it sounds this is a steam mop there are some really cool features that i want to show you guys so i'll try to run through Graphics as quickly as possible this thing is absolutely awesome so we'll just kind of start from the bottom and work our way up so on i see the a potato here, on the board do i win anything this little green trim piece around it and what this actually does is this allows you to use this steam mop on carpet so basically what this does is just super smooth plastic. So this is going to allow it, allow it to slide across carpet because this is going to kind of sit recessed on the inside of it. And this is super oh, smooth. Feel about that. So as you guys can see here, it's just moving around the carpet with absolutely zero. zero That's kind of cool that it will do that. 
So now if you want to switch to hardwood, ceramic, tile, whatever it is, all you have to do to be able to do that is just basically pop this off and now you're ready to go straight to your hardwood or your tile or anything like that. That's kind of so cool. This does have a little locking mechanism right here. So when you're storing it, it just pops in, pops out. These are actually removable, super easy. Just little Velcro and these little patterns right around here. And you here. can throw it right in the it washing machine and wash it. two of these, so that's pretty cool that they included that. And all you have to do to put it back on is just simply line it up with that. I didn't do it too good of a job, so we're just going to go ahead and take that I off. think you forgot to put his glasses right here on. here is where the water infill goes. Super simple. All you have to do is just twist this, fill it up with water, turn it back on, and that's all you have to do. Now, this little knob right here is going to increase the amount of steam Moving on forward, you have your power switch right here, nothing special, and then you're going to have a handle, which this is absolutely awesome. I can't wait to show you guys this, but this little handle right here is gonna come in handy. You have your cable wind up all the way throughout here, and then this is completely adjustable, so if you know, you're shorter or taller, all you have to do is just push this in and it adjusts like that. I mean, that's literally all you have to do is push that in. Super simple that's to do that. Cool. You have your handle up here, the other portion of your kind of wire hang up or tie. I lost right chat. So now, so if anybody's chatting, I apologize. I did do cannot now see chat. Is uh, it says it's temporarily unavailable for me. Okay, we're not gonna break it. Not sure why. A little bit difficult, but here on the bottom, you can actually detach the mop head itself, and then here you can detach the handle. So now what this is going to do is this machine actually comes into a handheld steamer. You get a ton, and I mean a ton of attachments. You get That's scrapers, cool. you get high pressure nozzles, and this thing gets super hot. So let's go ahead and turn this thing on. Let me get it plugged in and I'll show you what it looks like when we're working with it. I, mean, I might need one of those. So super long cord, by the way. I mean like super long, probably I'd say 23 foot power cord, yeah. So we'll go ahead and turn it on. And when you turn it on, you're gonna notice you get that little red light. That just hey, means don't point it's that at your face. Up. Just give it a little second. Uh, if anybody noticed what he just did. So it's still just heating trouble. everything up. It doesn't really take that long, but it's actually going right now. It might be a little bit hard to see, but I'll kind of increase this. He wants a steam burn. Just kind of, it's, it's still heating everything up. And yep, there we go. I mean, says, it, it, it's hey, really hard to see on video, Good morning. but this thing is like super, super hot. I mean, like really hot. So af actually, after it kind of gets going, you see the steam a little bit less after it gets the airflow moving. But this is great, especially with all these attachments like this scraper. This is going to make it super easy to like clean like your baseboard, your kitchen, your tiles, anything like that. And the fact, there we go. Now it's really going. As you can see right there. I had cold. That's super hot. I mean, I can't keep my hand there for too long. Like I'm an airbender like Avatar. I mean, it's super, super hot, yeah. Ouch. Yeah, so being that it turns into a, now from a mop to we're a gonna talk about steam, this. Guys, do not do what Nate just did. You will burn your hands. Steam burns are not fun. <laughs> cool little product, guys. And uh, as Mr. Dragon Blogger said, there is a ten dollar clickable coupon, so twenty percent off. Awesome. Yeah, Nate making me nervous. No, he didn't make me nervous. I'm just warning you guys. Safety first. Be careful. You know, unfortunately, I have to actually be the parent in the group. Uh, Compared to Nate, Nate and kind of warn you, steam burns. I mean, it's not a good thing to burn yourself. I mean, <laughs> now we're going to pop over to another product that actually Nate did. And this is the Snap Fresh Leaf Blower. Now, guys, I'm just going to play a local so video. To be talking and I know the sound, sound is really low. low. It's the way it right. edited, the unfortunately. Company called Din Share. Now this leaf blower is super awesome for an If you cannot hear it, I apologize. Not sure what is the deal with this one. The Snap Fresh Leaf Blower. 
it comes with <laughs> yeah. 20 I mean if you want to steam the wrinkles out of your face I guess you could use it for that but absolutely I, I'm not recommending it I guess it will plump up your face and fill in those wrinkles right I mean you know the steam will burn and you how it comes basically leaf blower so it's going to come in the box like this um, one of the really cool things I really like about this is this orange uh, color on it um, it kind of it kind of resembles some other name brands uh, I have no clue why this is so low and the battery install is very easy too a lot of especially when they're new a lot of products that use batteries like this that kind of latch in they're very like, you have to exactly really hard and getting them off you have to push in really hard but this one just slides in and out with ease but it's still super super solid then once you have it to this point with the battery right here all you have to do is take this first tube slide it on and it clicks on just like that and you don't have to continue i mean you could use this if this is what you want but it does come with an even further extension and getting this extension on is also really easy all you have to do is just slide it on and it clicks in with that little latch right there as you guys can see and uh yeah so you have two power modes on this um <laughs> all right so i don't really know how to showcase how well this thing works other than um let's see I have a few ideas. I'm not going to blow this right into the microphone because I will definitely make you guys go deaf. Serene, welcome to the stream. How you doing? I will make you guys go deaf if I blow this right into the microphone. So I'm not going to do that to you guys. But what I will do is I will kind of stand up, turn it on. Pull it back up. As you guys can hear, super, super loud. Uh, that's because it works really well. And as you guys pretty quick. That may be why we have it edited the video down. Closed caption. I actually, this is, uh, it's on my PC. It's not an uploaded video yet, so I don't have closed caption. Yeah. So we'll kind of close that out. That's the leaf blower, guys. I apologize. Uh, you know, like I said, that was a last minute video that we edited it together. Uh, kind of hard to hear and I apologize for that since it is a local file on my computer I do not know why the volume was so low unless it was due to we uh, Justin trying to adjust the the sound of the blower down yeah leaf blowing the blanket you know I would have stuck a plastic bag over and blew it up like a balloon just to have fun or uh, dumped uh, the wife's makeup on the ground and blew it all over just saying all right, guys, we're going to move over to the next product, of course. The next product is from Rimfo. This is their mas uh, massager or massage therapy gun. Hey, everyone. So I have an awesome Rimfo product to show you here. This is their portable massage. Can you believe I lost you chat? The manual on the left side. It tells you everything you need to know about it, but I'm going to basically fill you in. So you hey, guys, we have a few more products left, um, so make off, sure to enter really our nice giveaways. Place. It feels really nice. Has a really As nice always, the Obsbot in me ends tonight. We are also drawing two five dollar gift cards at the end of this. Uh, the EF Echo Flow River is ending in like nine days, I think. And this is the charger for it. The actual massage. Uh, Sadie Lucci, I believe that is. Thank you for the follow. And then, if I pronounce that wrong, I apologize. I am actually staring down at the phone trying to see that. Tells you the names of all of them in the front. You just open it up and it is called, there is the five dollar gift it card link guys head. it's it names all of them right here on page five and so each head has its different purposes and it just depends on what you want to massage whether it's your arms your legs your back shoulders whatever it may be but here's the actual gun itself first you can see that it has this nice rubber handle which gives you a good grip on it and it's not too heavy, so it feels really good in the hand. It's really easy to maneuver around your body wherever you want to get, whatever spot is tough and needs massaging. I'm going to go ahead and insert a head here so you can kind of see it. Uh, let's go with the bald head. I'm going to pull it out of the case real quick. And the one thing I do like about the case, it keeps them snug, so you don't have to worry about them falling out. But yeah, when you want to put it in, you just simply push it in until this little ring uh, comes in contact with the little silver part. And when you want to remove it, you simply pull and twist just a little bit, and it comes right out. But let me put it back in. Don't mind me, guys. On, you simply hold this button for a little bit. Checking something. About three seconds. 
it shows you the power rating and it starts immediately as soon as it turns on so right now yeah. this is the first setting and it has five settings so two three four five of course the higher you go the faster it's going to be the more it's going to oscillate forward and backwards and of course the more drain it's going to have on the battery so i typically keep mine on about the third settings because that that is the one that's most comfortable for me as far as the pressure goes and it's it's no, the Dragon Egg's uh, fifth level. stance see, should supposedly be here well. next week, everybody. Really good. Even just That's the message I was just ball. getting and I was checking. Really well. So, and it has a nice hopefully next field week field. we'll get a showcase of the Dragon the Eggs with the light-up stands. Is very firm. If they come so on time. About using this head, especially if uh, it's been a long wait waiting for these. Um, massage setting. Because it is quite firm. You don't want to hurt yourself. But yeah, you know, me too. I can't. Hopefully, they're as nice as they looked uh, in the uh, pictures. Your muscles may feel. But I can't overall, wait to have the I dragon eggs up. This mini portable massage gun. So, if you're looking for a really good Rimfo product, one that I would definitely endorse, this is the Rimfo mini massage uh, portable. So, before we move on to the next couple products, I'm going to pop over here and talk about a few things, guys. As always, we have several uh, giveaways going on, so make sure to enter that. But also, we have more streams going on. Tonight, I believe it's either... Uh, tonight is Nikita will be on tonight streaming. Then tomorrow, I'll be back. And then Saturday, of course, I'll be back again. Then Sunday, Mr. and Mrs. Dragon Blogger. And then you guys will have me for a week. And then they're gone for a week. So you guys will be stuck with me some more. So always make sure to those. We always have lots of products coming. But on top of that... If you guys see items or products that we have not showcased that you guys would like seeing or showcased, always make sure to let us know. And we'll try to get the products as we can to showcase them. We always love to hear from you guys to see what you guys want to uh, hear and see. Now, on top of that, guys, I will actually... Stuck, never stuck. We love them, team. Uh, on top of that, guys, I finally got a new projector screen and I finally got... The Wii Max, uh, the Wii Max projector redone with a better video. So I'm going to actually be adding that to tomorrow's carousel to show you guys the Wii Max with the new video and how well it worked and how bright it is. I am actually absolutely excited to showcase that product in a better view because the first videos I did of it, I was not happy with. Uh, Abby, uh, I believe that is a relative of mine. Thank you for the follow. But I'm pretty sure that's not your last name. <laughs> now, guys, we're going to move on to the next product. This is a wrist brace, of course. Oh, actually, I did not show you guys the backpack, did I? So we'll do the backpack. Right, I believe this bag here. Already my sister won one of these. With everything that I've seen from this brand, so I'm really excited to see this one right here. Yeah, yeah. You should yell at her about that. Packaging. I'm pretty sure that's not her last name. She's super nice. <laughs> Model curve. But the packaging is super nice. They don't use a lot of materials, which is always good. I'm a little bit younger than that. Me too. <laughs> I, mean, I can't That's believe I lost super chat. Nice, look at that. So first off, let's start from the back. So we've got these nice padded um, shoulder straps here. Do you mean Do you that like the shit yeah, we like the backpack. Very nice shoulder straps. They're both adjustable, of course. It so might not have been. Bag here. So this actually folds over, and you've got these nice little magnet clasps here. Yeah, animals. I love anything that has the animals at Dragon Blogger. We actually have a page for them, guys. If you guys want to see all the animals that I don't think it's are on here, or style. if you guys want to post your own really animals, we always want to see the those look too. Of those two buckles on the front of the backpack. So then you've also got this nice front pocket here if you want to put any pens or maybe maybe a granola bar or something in there. I don't know. But the oh, zipper granola? works really well, which is always Stroll good. full of chocolate. We're good to go. Zippers work well. And on the inside here. A lot deeper than you'd expect. It's got this nice exactly. strap and pocket. Where's the catnip, lady? Laptop, Where's the catnip? An iPad, whatever you should be carrying with you, <laughs> tablet or anything. You can just hook that down, and it keeps your items safe and secure, which is very good to have. And 
can. The zip I believe, yeah, there's, there's a great cat there. behind her on the ground, too. Pocket right here. If you guys did not notice that one, also. Down in there, maybe like a textbook or something. This would be a really good college bag. Right on. Because it has enough room for whatever classes you're going to that day, but it's not going to overweigh you with too much, you know? But I love the fabric of this because it's super durable. I feel like it could take wear and tear very easily. The stitching oh, it's head itself cool, looks man. awesome. Do you not know where it came that, from, but it it's got to go has already. This cool little charging port that uh, the uh, that this brand seems to be very good at implementing into their bag. So this part here actually connects to a USB, so you can I'll actually charge chat your back. device. I can see chat on my desk. Charge oh. there, and then on the inside you can actually connect. I got to break down and order the monitor. Dark it is. I can kind of. Can't do it no more. This little pocket right here, the zipper, actually connects to a cable that you can actually plug your power bank into. So you see the back of that right there? Mm -hmm. That's where your power bank can plug into. So super, super nice. And the charging stuff on this is dope. Especially if you're someone who is studying abroad, I feel like this would be a great backpack for you because it would pack up nicely in luggage while also giving you tons of zippers and buttons to keep your products and all of your school stuff safe. And you also have this nice little charging port should you ever get lost or anything. Your so guys, that is the Modoker Vintage Leather School College Backpack. Cool little backpack, guys, if you guys need one of those. Awesome little product. Now we're going to move on to the wrist brace for carpal tunnel. And I believe Mrs. Dragon Blogger and her mother did this one. And of course, this is from Fetal. Uh, guys, Fetal, if you've never seen, we have actually showcased a lot of their products before. Very cool products. Dragon Bloggers here. Today we are looking at this wrist brace. Now these can be beneficial if you have a sports injury or if you have arthritis, carpal tunnel, or any conditions that you would need to brace your hand. Head your colds wrist. gotta go. Now this is meant for your left, and this size is oh, small. Appreciate it, no feet. problem. We only have like this two more items left anyways. Support, so we're gonna be well out of here very shortly. <laughs> Make sure you always- But I appreciate you popping in. And now my mom's gonna show you how to put this- uh, That is now Mrs. Mrs. J a Dragon Blogger. And carpal Justin is at work. Hands and wrists. These are easy to use. Not a problem, Haley. Thank you for popping in. Truly good appreciate it. Quality textiles. These braces are very beneficial for I will those try. that do suffer <laughs> from these conditions. You simply want to pull these straps tight, tight enough that you're immobile but not tight enough that it causes circulation issues. So take care when you're adjusting the straps. This provides complete control. Now my question is, Mrs. Dragon Blogger, do you like this set or the set we showed yesterday better? As you can see, it fits perfectly. It's not uncomfortable in any way. So if you're looking for a good stable brace, check out this one. Guys, we're going to be moving on to our last couple products. This is from Sojo's. Uh, yeah, that's what I was wondering because I don't, I kind of, I don't like the metal brace rubbing on my arm all the time. So I'm kind of tempted to get the ones you have that we showcased yesterday to see how well they work. Now, guys, we're going to move on to the Sojo's Classic Aviators. Justin did this video for us. And then we'll be moving on to our last product and then picking some winners. So stick around for that, of course. I really like the look of these aviators. I really like the way the lenses look on these. So I normally don't wear aviators or like aviators. And a lot of aviators are a lot bigger. These are actually kind of like to say smaller aviators. But I like the way the, these look. These are kind of nice. Do not play poker Again, with those on, so guys. It's going to give away your hand. Options. If you look at all the combinations <laughs> of styles on each model, they, there's hundreds of different styles and options to choose from. And this one looks pretty cool. I don't know if any look good on me or not, honestly. So, again, glasses are very subjective on whether or not you like the look or you like the style. Very subjective. But they're all good at blocking out UV light and helping, you know, you not have that sun in your eyes when you're driving. 
Now we're going to move on to our last product, guys, and this is also from Sojo's. This is their fashioned style round uh, sunglasses. Uh, these are a vintage style, of course, and we're going to show you guys this, and then we're going to pick these are a couple called gift card winners. These are called the classic round um, sunnies. SJ if you guys need the links, also, there are all the links of our active giveaways. Side. This is their dark black color. So these are a little different than the other ones. You can see how these kind of little like triangular wing tips on them. So yeah, these are the Sojo SJ two hundred six sevens. You can yeah, see those are not Justin. You can see the plastic frames. These are not polarized, but they do a really good job dimming the. Again, don't play poker with these. Light. It's going to give your hand away, very guys. Very I don't want you to lose color temperature light while playing panel. poker. So they're good for me to test sunglasses while it's blinding me, you know, and that kind of thing. So this is the next option from Sojo's. So that is the Sojo stream keeps freezing for you. I may not. It's not my end. Might want to check. I uh, I actually saw another stream doing it though, so I know it's not my end because I can actually see it. Ah, uh, the obs. Well, I actually have another one, sis. If I have to send you one, I can send you one. I have a couple. Just saying. It's my Mac. Ah, all right. So, guys, we are now going to move on to the giveaway. Of course, make sure you are entered to win. We are doing two $5 gift cards. But, again, the OBSBOT Amy guys ends tonight at midnight. We will be picking the winner tomorrow. Then we will be contacting them. And, of course, the winner has, like, 48 hours to reply or something like that. You know, all that jazz. It will say in the actual links. Today, we're doing two $5 gift cards, of course. But before we do that, I'm going to announce a few things. First, we have several more streams coming up, including tonight at 9 p.m. Eastern, and Kato will be on. Then tomorrow, I will be back for my normal stream, of course. Then tomorrow night, you'll have Nate, and then Saturday, you'll see me again. But the big one of the week is always the Sunday stream, where Mr. and Mrs. Dragon Blogger always do a lot of giveaways and a nice fancy stream where you guys get jewelry included or other products. So make sure to do that. Now, if you guys are all entered and ready to uh, win, we'll actually pick some winners. I will actually load Gleam up right now, and I'll kind of move over and get this ready. So if you guys are ready, let me know. I will click Interact. Of course, I have to interact here and act like I'm interacting with stuff. Let's get this going. Wow, it actually loaded rather quick today. All right, let's draw our first winner, guys. Tina H., uh, you won our first giveaway. So you will be contacted with your gift card. We will contact you. Congratulations, Tina. Uh... <laughs> Congratulations. Of course, we could just ignore and just keep going. All right, guys, let's draw our second winner. Our second winner is BLH. BLH, you are our second winner, buddy. BLH, where are you? I know I just saw you. Congratulations, man. We will contact you guys with your gift cards. So, we appreciate everybody being here. Uh, hopefully, I feel better tomorrow. As you guys can see, my eyes are drooping. My head's hurting. Uh, head cold is uh, kicking me. But I'll be back tomorrow, of course. Guys, thank you for the great uh, time. We'll see you guys later. And have a good one, everybody.